hanging off the back of a jeep is a traditional form of transportation in the coffee region. I myself, along with Elias and a young couple from Germany, hung off the back of a jeep to go see some palm trees in the mountains, and it was legitimately terrifying. That sign, 50 kilometers, that's that's not for me, that's, that's not for gringos. Neither is that toll sign. I'm not going to pay this toll I'm going right around it with the other motorcycles. We don't stop. We don't pare. No pare. We covered around 100 miles round trip in our journey with some pretty serious changes in elevation. See this large bridge we're approaching now going up this steep incline I'm just punching it on this poor little bike just giving it all she's got tropical Andes mountains ladies and gentlemen beautiful Such extreme and grueling conditions require that the pilot and co-pilot drink espresso and fresh squeezed juice. We saw a party bus, heard some music. Now I'm gonna drive right on into this place. Be sure not to leave anything important behind at your pit stops. Even the pinchiest of gringos make mistakes. I'm a little lost. I feel like I want to go to the right, so I follow the arrows. But wait, it says something about a rodeo school? What? I don't know. I look up, and I'm pointing the wrong direction on a highway. Not ideal. What happened there? <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> man. That's so fucking. God damn, who the fuck designed this stupid shit? Where the fuck am I going? There's the entrance for the rodeo school. I erroneously used their exclusive off ramp there. Um, this intersection was actually designed by Dr. Seuss. A lot of people don't know that. 